Hello and good morning once again. I'm Ariel. And I'm Sochim. Welcome to HG Live for the week of Monday, October 7, 2013. Let's start this week off together with the Pledge of Allegiance. Please stand. Put your right hand over your heart. Ready? Begin. I, I pledge, pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States, States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you. Please be seated. Ruby's outside right now with Xavier from Diversity Den with a great idea about how together we can stomp out bullying. Ruby? Hi, I'm Ruby and I'm here with Xavier from Diversity Den. Yep, that's me. Okay, so what is Diversity Den all about? Diversity Den is all about trying to promote peace and trying to get rid of all the bad things in our community, such as bullying and like trash and littering. And we try to work as one force to, to make our community and our school a better place for everyone. How does Diversity Den help you in your life? Diversity Den has, has helped me in my life because it teaches me good morals and traits. They'll help me in the real world in different situations and they'll help me make friends. And it teaches me good morals, such as like honesty, you know, don't tease people, things like that. Okay, um, what do you like most about Diversity Den? I like most about, what I like most about Diversity Den is the wide range and variety of people we have there. Because of this, it's, it's really fun and easy to make friends, and we, we often make fun relationships with people. And it's really fun because we get to work together. Okay, how can we all work as a team to stop prevent bullying? Because if we all get together and we all stand up as one force, the bullies, which are now, you know, just left there, they will look at us, such a big force, and they'll say, mm, maybe I should stop bullying, you know? All these guys, they think that, you know, it's best to, it's bullying is bad, maybe I should stop. And I think that will really make our community a better place and, and our school a better place for everyone. Speaking of bullying, uh, Diversity Den and the HJA Student Council has partnered up with hundreds of schools across the nation in Pacers Bullying Prevention Month. We, so not only will we be focusing on honesty this month, we will also be having activities to prevent bullying. Two of these activities that are very important will be happening on Wednesday, October 9th. And they are the Unity Day where we will be all wearing orange to, as I said, stand as one force against bullying to show our unity. And after school on that day, from 2.45 to 3.15, we will all gather after school and we will go around the community trying to get as many people as we can to join with us to show that we are against bullying. So always remember that the end of bullying starts with you. Thank you, Xavier, for your wonderful time. Now let's take it back with Jose with a few words of wisdom. Thanks, Ruby and Xavier, for the scoop about Diversity Den. Good morning, Home Guardians Academy. This is Jose with a few words of wisdom. Bishop Fulton Sheen was a great American Catholic writer and speaker. Listen to his words. Freedom does not mean the right to do whatever you please, but rather to do what we ought to do. In other words, having freedom doesn't mean we are free to do whatever we want, whenever we want, to whomever we want. It means we have the freedom of choice. And how do we choose? How do we know what we ought to do or ought not to do? Jiminy Cricket says, let your conscience guide you. That sounds like good advice to me. Today, ask yourself how you are exercising your freedom. With something to think about, this Jose. Make it a great day or not, the choice is yours. Hi, I'm Saul. And I'm Giselle, and we're for the middle school leadership team. Don't you ever feel bad for the people that you see in the streets are asking for money just to get a little scrap of food? In the United States, 47% of the people living here, including children and teens like you, are starving because nobody wants to help them. Our purpose of our announcement is to notify you that leadership and PTSA and FBLA will be holding a canned food drive for the needy in our community. If you could buy an iPhone that costs $400, can you at least buy some food for somebody that really needs it? So come out and help our community and have a nice day. Oh, wait, you forgot something. Oh yeah, I forgot. The class that raises the most cans will get their very own pizza party or the ice cream party. 
and the person who brings up the most cans will get a $25 gift card to AMC Movies. So come out and help our community and have a nice day. Bye. Now for some announcements. On Tuesday, there will be a makeup picture day, so just impress if you need a retake. There will also be a basketball game Tuesday at Ramirez against CFIS. The girls will play at 5 and the boys will play immediately after the girls at 6. Hope to see you there because I know I'll be, of course. I'm on the team. <laughs> like Xavier said, Wednesday is wear orange thing. Wear orange and take a stand to stomp out bowling. Then after school, join us for a community walk as we march around the neighborhood from 2 p.m. to 3 p.m. in an effort to stomp out bullying. And after that, ask your parents to take you to Johnny's Burgers. Oh, I want to try that place so bad. Did you know that Johnny's Burgers is hosting a fundraiser from noon to 9 p.m.? They will be donating a portion of the proceeds to HGA. Awesome. Now let's check in with, the, with Brianna for this week's weather forecast. Brianna? Thanks, Ariel. I'm Brianna, your weather girl. This week's weather won't be quite as warm as last week, but it won't be too cold either. Today will be the hottest day of the week at around 89 degrees. Tomorrow, it will start cooling down to 79 degrees. On Wednesday, it's going to be the lowest it'll be all week at around 68 degrees. On Thursday, we should have some clouds and there's even a chance of rain, but the weather should be at a comfortable 72 degrees. Then on Friday, the weather should start to creep back up a couple more degrees to around 74 degrees. Amazing weather, isn't it? It's like a roller coaster up and down. I know I'm going to love this weather. That's our show for this week. I'm Ariel. And I'm Sochi. From all of us here at HG TV, have a great week and remember to dream big. Dream big!